again my favorite Texas this time in Amarillo for the first time yes and here you see what we're gonna go through tonight if we're gonna find the time because there's just so many hours in the day that we can shoot and night and I arrived a little later so let's get right to it makeup is now done hair is done so I think we're ready what do you think so we're just starting our first look going all red for this one shoes included wanna see so 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 cute <laughs> beautiful dear let me show you the first set that we did obviously i was all dressed in red during this video you're gonna see all kinds of little pictures here and there from the photo shoot so if i were you i would watch the whole thing because you never know when you're gonna see a picture coming out and the red was from top to the bottom from bottom to the top from shoes to the lipstick from lipstick to the shoes and yes, we did two different setups, as you can see in the images. First setup was more of a dramatic lighting. The lighting was just free hanging there, just a prop. A little dangerous, I know that's why I was not right underneath. You never know when it can go down. And on the other set, we did more of a high key setup, which is flattering for anybody, I think. Especially if the lighting is set up right. Here in a bathroom you can see how the laundry actually looks on normal floors and light. It actually does look a little burgundy, but that's why you have a nice camera and nice lighting. You try to make it even better. La 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 la. Here is more of the high key setup as I was talking about. And it's always so helpful to have the big screen right next to you so you can really see what are you shooting right now because the camera screen can be so difficult and it's a bummer if you end up with pictures that at the end are either blurry or there is little thing that could have been changed and saves you tons of time in photoshop so why not if you have the option to have a screen right next to you laptop or screen like this please use it it is helpful for both model and the photographer I love the images we got. I don't think you can go wrong with my skin tone and the red laundry and the whole setup. So I was pretty pleased with what we got. Nice.
I just found the most comfortable spot in the studio and it's gigantic potato like bean bag filled with I have no idea what but it feels so so good to just lay here while we're changing the set so don't mind me I'm just gonna take a quick nap like 30 second one we're just slowly finishing up and the next look is getting kind of funky with the crazy background comes a crazy outfit you would never guess what i have on right now just by looking at my head no 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 all wrong put those assumptions away because we're just starting starting the set but also ending the day because we played in the studio quite a lot and it's time to go sleep Let's look at you, look at you, and where's the bed? Ooh, we need to go further. What a beautiful spot. I'm always so happy when I get to stay in a nice place that's actually pretty and comfortable. Hmm, I appreciate love very much. Oh, I love, love, love when places have rope I can use. So this is just perfect, perfect, perfect. Now just take the makeup off and let's get ready for tomorrow, shall we? Yes, we shall because Veronica got three hours of sleep last night. So waking up at 4.35 in the morning is not my ideal day. So let's get this sleep going. Good morning. Well, with new morning comes a new shoot. And today I was told we're going to be shooting somewhere outdoors. Where? I don't know yet. What? I don't know yet, we will see. We're on our way to the Palo Duro Canyon in Amarillo, Texas. I heard it's one of the second largest canyons in the United States, but I did not do my research, so please don't quote me on that. I should have done my research before saying this, but I just said it so there is no way back and I am not deleting it. Here you can see what we've been through throughout this shoot. This shoot wasn't that long because it was so hot outside and we did not expect the grass to be so 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 long it was raining as i've been told so much that the grass just grew enormously huge so what is normally a few inches was now almost up to my face crazy crazy we still got some beautiful images and it was beautiful scenery to see but wow we just did not expect this so we spent here probably eight minutes all together and i already got bit so many times <laughs> and my butt cheek is all red i cannot show you on the camera but trust me it does not look good <laughs> can't believe i forgot to tell you about the mosquito bites i guess i just don't mm, remember AC, the bad stuff AC. that happened to me so i erased the mosquito bites out of my memory completely we just switched the locations to get some kind of a different scenery. Find a little water running through here. I heard this area hosts some theater during the summer and probably most of the year. <laughs> it's beautiful. I was able to put this little dress on, but it was so windy, so I gotta be a little careful. And then well, it got, got so I'll hot that more. this was just the best setting for me. And I feel bad for the photographer going into the water with me just to get the images. But this just felt so good. I wish we could just stay there. It was so pleasant, like a natural jacuzzi. It was just so nice. We all needed to cool off. Now off we go, we have more adventures to do. And we'll stop by there, right? that's kind of on the way. As you can see, I don't get to see statues like this love very often, so this is pretty cool to me. I just wish I had my boots with me. And here you can read more about Tex Randall because I took a picture for ya. Yep, yeah, thank me later. It's pretty cool. And now 
now before heading to the airport we were still able to stop by the famous Cadillac Ranch where everybody goes to be a little gangster because you can spray on these old Cadillacs and it just feels so cool I love putting my name on it however the moment I turn around somebody was already tanning over my name it was maybe a two minute spam of time so yeah. how crazy is that? <laughs> But what a nice cherry on top for this lovely trip. Thank you, Amarillo. I'll hopefully see you next time. I had a great time. Bye.